Hello and welcome back everyone. Today we are going to continue with the same chapter in table. Whereas we are going to learn a last subtopic and that is adding and subtracting in table. So let's start the lesson. Rules of addition. Now we first have learned the rules of addition. Then only we can add in table. So the first rule is that when the signs are the same we have to add and keep the same sign for example minus 2 plus minus 4 is equal to minus 6 when the signs are different the sub we have to subtract and use the sign of the larger number for example minus 2 plus 4 is equal to 2 or also 2 plus minus 4 is equal to minus 2. This is now karaoke time. Same signs add and keep different signs subtract. Keep the sign of the higher number then it will be exact. So now let us solve this question. Minus 1 plus 3. As we learnt in the addition rule, whenever the signs are different, we have to subtract and keep the sign of the larger number. So, when we subtract minus 1 and 3, we will get 2. And we will put it positive 2 because a positive 3 is larger than minus 1. So, the answer is 2. This is another question. Minus 6 plus minus 3. As we learned in the addition rules, when the signs are same, we'll just have to add and keep the same sign. So when we'll add minus 6 plus minus 3, we will get minus 9. So this is our answer. Now we will learn about the additive inverse. The additive inverse or opposites of two numbers add to equal 0. For example, the additive inverse of 3 is minus 3. To explain this, we learned the rules of addition that if the two signs are different, we will have to subtract them and keep this sign of the larger number. So when we subtract positive 3 and minus 3, we will get 0. And 0 is neither a positive number or not negative number. So we will just write 0 as the answer. So that means the active inverse of 3 is minus 3. We will use the active inverse for subtraction problems. Now, before continuing on to subtraction, we will have to first learn what is subtraction. What is the difference between 7 minus 3 and 7 plus minus 3? Yes, 7 minus 3 is equal to 4. Whereas 7 plus minus 3 is also equal to 4. The only difference is that 7 minus 3 is a subtraction problem and 7 plus minus 3 is an addition problem. So that means the subtracting is the same as adding the opposite. To learn the subtraction rule, our first rule will be that we have to keep change change. That means 7 minus 3 means we will keep 7 and then change the set, the sign to positive and then we will change it to minus 3. And when we do that, we will get 7 plus minus 3 and then we will get 4 as our answer. Now, let us learn about the rules of subtraction. When subtracting, we have to change the subtraction to adding the opposite, which is keep change change, and then we have to follow our addition rules. For example, minus 4 minus minus 7. It will become minus 4 plus plus 7. So, Different signs is equal to subtract and use the larger sign. So our answer will be positive 3 as minus 4 when we 
interact minus 4 and 7, we will get 3. And as 7, positive 7 is larger, we will put it as positive 3 is the answer. For a second example, minus 3 minus positive 7. So it will be converted into minus 3 plus minus 7. This for same signs, we'll have to add and keep the sign. So our answer will be minus 10. Now, these are some more questions based on subtractions of integers. So now let us solve this question. Which is equivalent to minus 12 minus minus 3? So when we will use the keep changing method, we will get minus 12 plus 3. So this is our answer. So the answer is the second option. Minus 12 plus 3. This is our second question. 7 minus minus 2 equals to what? We'll use the keep change change method. We'll, we'll get 7 plus 2. And as for the addition rules, whenever the signs are same, we'll have to add both of them and keep the same sign. So it will be 7 plus 2 is equal to 9. And both are positive. So it, the answer will be positive 9. So that means the fourth option is the correct answer. So what did we learn today? We learned how to add integers, rules of addition, additive inverse, what is subtraction and rules of subtraction. So if you guys like the video, please like, share, subscribe and hit on notification bell to get more notifications and upload more videos. Thank you and have a nice day.